Hey everybody and welcome back to my channel. Today I have a special treat for y'all. I got in a brand new palette that I'm so excited about. I'll give y'all a hint. It is the Morphe 3502 and I'm not going to go in depth and do a whole lot of swatches or anything. I do some swatches like finger swatches are the ones that I use in this look which by the way check out these colors this blend I even used a Morphe brush for the first time this brand is so much more incredible than I thought so here is the palette there's a nice mix of shimmers mattes oranges reds yellowish colors browns there's this black down here golds it's just got a little bit of everything if you are like me I am super into the red looks, the orange looks, the brown looks. They just make my heart happy. So this is definitely a palette that I had to get my hands on. And for $23, and I got it at Ulta, so I got points. And I'm up to like a thousand points now. I'm so excited. But no, I promise I didn't spend a thousand dollars, Mom, because I know you're watching. I just got a whole lot of bonus points. And I'm excited and I need to know what to get with those. So tell me what y'all want to see. And uh, I'll redeem some of my points for a product that y'all would like to see reviewed if you give me something good. So uh, I'm going to show y'all how to do this look. We're not in voiceover mode today. I'm just going to talk you through it. Um, but yeah, this is the look. And I am living for it. Like, this look is incredible. So if y'all want to see how to do this and you want to see how all this works, how it blends, how it applies, just keep watching and it's time for the tutorial. Oh, if you are already subscribed to my channel, hit that red button down there and I hit that little bell so you can be notified more than likely when I post if the algorithm works right for us. <laughs> And uh, be sure to come back and check out my other content. I have tons of other videos, lots of reviews. Let me know what kind of videos you like best. And yeah, so into the tutorial, you guys. All right, so we're just gonna dive right into this palette. I'm gonna try to get the names right for y'all. But uh, since it's just on this plastic and not on the palette, I'm not promising anything. So here it is in all its glory. And I made sure to wear a shirt. You can't see it, but it has red on it, I promise. Just so that I could do a red look with this palette. Okay, so the first shade I'm going to go into is the very top left one. This appears to be the lightest. And this is Universal. And I'm just going to take it to set all over my lid. And I guess I'm just going to use my brand new, my first ever Morphe brush, which I'm super psyched about if I could figure out how to open it. Y'all, I swear they dummy proof these things just so I can't get into them. So this is the M441. It is just a fluffy blending brush with these goat hairs that I absolutely adore. So we are just going to take this on here and just put it a little bit of everywhere. It's a little dark for what I usually use to set, but this is probably going to be a darker look. So no biggie. Okay. So the next shade I want to dip into is, oh, what is the name of you? Heat. That's right here. And I'm just going to dip into this and put it in my crease. Okay, so this is super bright. Um, the next thing I want to dig into, because y'all honestly, this is the reason I think everybody wanted the palette. I'm going to dip into 
fire right here. This is that gorgeous red that everybody's been talking about. <clears throat> and it's really what sets this palette apart. So we're just going to blow this out in the crease too. Okay, so now that I have both of those in there, I'm going to go ahead and take my dark color for my crease right here. And I'm just going to put a teeny bit of that in the outer corner. And we are going to see what happens. And this is incredible, y'all. I didn't believe that there was such a thing as quality brushes. I thought they were all the same. But I'm already a believer. This is amazing. I do still love my cheap brushes just because if I mess them up, I'm not losing much money and it's all right <clears throat> for sometimes. But this is amazing. I am just blown away by how much better this blends. This is incredible, like, <clears throat> usually nothing can blend this eye because I can't see it right. This is like the most flawless blend I think I've ever had. So that's going to be my crease. Really simple, but I got that bright red that I wanted. And I want to use the red on my lid, but I'm not going to. But I am going to show you a one swatch of that metallic red that's in this palette y'all it is so pretty and i want to use it but i know realistically that's just going to be a little over the top because i'm on my way to work and today is actually casual friday so i'm already over the top <clears throat> so instead i am going to pick up this color right here this is polished and that last one the black was whiz so we're just going to pick up polish and we're just going to get it on our fingertip and put it all over the lid because it is super pretty. So here we go. Hmm. Okay, so this one kind of shocks me a little. You can see it's got a really orange tint, but like in the pan it get, gave me like a champagne kind of feeling. So definitely not exactly what it looked like in the pan, but I'll take it. This is still really pretty. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and hop off here and do my face makeup real quick. And then I'll be right back for the lower lash line. Okay guys, so I'm back and my face is done. So the last thing I'm gonna do is just go back into these colors. We're going to go into Universal Heat and Fire, which is just the brown, the orange, and the red, and just stick them on this lower lash line. And we're going to use the same brush to see how it performs for this. Okay, so definitely worked out nicely. <clears throat> so now we've just got to go in and get our inner corner and our brow bone. There's not anything in here that's just real good for the brow bone. But for this inner corner, I'm going to grab Pure right here. And depending on how this lays down, it may go in the brow bone too. So we will just it's definitely pretty okay so that isn't one let's just stick this over here okay so this is super pretty but I still feel like it's a little bit too much for the brow bone so I'm just going to take some of my champagne pop and I'm just going to 
stick. Well, y'all know what I forgot to do. Look at these brows. That's what I forgot to do. I knew it took me less time than normal. And y'all, I don't ever go fancy with my brows unless I just really got time, which I don't today. I just make sure they are filled in and that is it. Okay, so my brows are uneven, but they are on now. <laughs> That was almost close because I really did forget. So we're just going to take champagne pop and just put a little bit up here just to highlight that brow bone. So that's going to be my thing here. I wish there was one light shade to set my eyes with that was matte and one light shimmer to put in my brow bone. But I do understand like every palette can't have every color you need. So that's totally okay. So me and this 3502 are about to be best friends. So the last thing I'm going to do is I'm actually going to test out this Essence Mascara for y'all. This is like five bucks and supposed to be like the cheapest best mascara in the whole world. But look at this difference. I don't know if y'all can like, y'all see this all the way for five dollars. Oh yeah, I'll take that. Okay guys, so... This is going to be our final look today. Let me zoom you out a little after we... Okay, so wrong way. Like always, everything I use is going to be in the description. I hope you all enjoyed this. If you want more tutorials with this palette or if you want a more in-depth review with full swatches, let me know. I definitely think this is going to be one of the best palettes I have, especially out of my Morphe ones. It is a lot more like the Jaclyn Hill palette than it is like the regular Morphe's. So this is definitely an amazing palette. It is definitely worth your money and I don't care what anyone says. It is a lot different than the 35.0, which I also have, but this is a lot different. The tones are different. The colors are different. Just a completely different deal. <clears throat> so I'm going to let y'all go for today. I will see y'all, I think, on Tuesday because I think it is Saturday today. So I will see y'all on Tuesday. I hope you enjoyed this video. And uh, bye guys.